guys, so um, when we're going to teach the dog to actually bring the toy to you, what I like to do is we're pretty much just going to be pairing um, whenever we did the drop it with putting it in the basket. So I'm going to get a toy that my dog really likes. I'm going to toss it for her. She's going to go get it and then bring it back to me. And then after she brings it back to me, I'm going to ask her to drop it in this basket. So you'll see that I very strategically have placed this basket right in front of me. So I'm going to reward her when she actually drops the toy in the basket. But in her mind, she's just giving it to me. But eventually what you're going to be doing is teaching them that the toy goes in the basket, they get a reward. So this is definitely a very hard one for your dog to learn. You're going to be using two basic training techniques to kind of teach them this one. So one of them is called shaping. So shaping is pretty much when you reward every small behavior towards what you're asking your dog to do until they eventually kind of get the picture. Um, the other one that we're going to be using that we showed you the other day with the quick tricks is we're going to be using luring to kind of draw the dog into what we want to do. So these are kind of some tips on how to teach your dog some more advanced tricks. Um, what you want to do is practice these over and over again until your dog has it pretty well. So that way eventually you don't have to use luring or shaking. But to get started, this is how you teach those tricks. So Mika, come here. So I've got my treats right here in this hand. I'm going to take your ball. Come get your ball. Get it. Good girl. Mika, bring it, bring it, bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Oh, that was close. So she doesn't get rewarded she didn't actually put it in the box. Come get it. Get your ball. Good girl. Mika, bring it. Bring it. Yes, drop it. So close enough. So we're going to reward her because that's shaping. Ready? Okay, ready? Where's your ball? Good girl. Bring it. Over the camera, really quick, and we're just gonna pick up where we left off. Mika, go get it. Go get your ball. Good girl, go get it. Mika, bring it here. Bring it. Bring it. Good girl. Good girl. Yes. So, as she starts to bring it closer to the basket, I'm gonna reward her for that because shaping is just when you're rewarding every behavior that gets close to what you actually want them to do. Throw a ball. Go get it. Where's your ball? No, go get your ball. Go get it. Good girl. Get your ball. No, get your ball. Mika, get your ball. Get your ball. No, go get your ball. Mika, go get your ball. Go get, go get your ball. No. Mika, ball. Go get your ball. Go get your ball. Good girl. Hey. Come here. Look. Mika. Mika. Ready? Go get your ball. Go get your ball. Good girl. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Mika, bring your ball. Yes. Good girl. So she gets rewarded that time for bringing me the ball drop it in the basket. So if they get it in the basket, that's extra points. Show her again. Ready? Mika, go get your ball. No, no, no. Go get your ball. Good girl. Get your ball. Yes, bring it, bring it, bring it. Bring it. No, you gotta bring it. So this is pretty common. They might try to like uh, drop the ball before they get close to it. Drop it. Hey, look. Look silly. Come here. Ready? Ready? Mika. Hey, stop. Go get it. Good girl. Mika, come here. Drop it. Yeah! Good girl! So she gets lots of reward for actually doing that one. So again, this is just kind of the groundwork. It's pretty sloppy right now. We're going to work on cleaning it up and just kind of pairing the commands and teaching her what we're actually wanting her to do. But realistically, this is probably what a lot of this is going to look like until your dog gets the command. So Mika. <laughs> now she just wants to find the treats that are buried at the bottom. Mika. Ready? Ready? Yeah! Good girl! Come here, Mika! Lots of reward, and that's how you'll teach your dog to kind of clean up their toys. Good job. Very good girl.